Yep, that's me. You're probably wondering how I got myself into this situation. Well... Okay. Today I came up with quite an original idea. Pretty much I'm gonna try to finish as many Wii games in 24 hours as possible. I hope you enjoy and let's get right into the games. The first game today that we are gonna be playing is one of the most revolutionary games ever made for the Wii. It introduced new kind of mechanics like uh, motion controls very well. Pretty much everyone and their grandmother was playing this game. It came bundled in with the Wii, that's how good the game was. I'm obviously talking about the game world. Madagascar 2 Escape to Africa. I'm gonna open up the chat now and uh, probably turn on the Wii as well. I haven't done that yet, so. I have quite a bit of games here. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. That's probably one of my favorite Wii games ever. Sorry. Okay. Toys for Bob, oh shit. Those are the same who did the Spyro Re Reignited Trilogy remasters. What? I never knew Madagascar existed. Where, where are the rest of them? Okay, I got one. Dude, it's so easy to catch these ones. Anyways, I have like fond memories of this game. But this is quite cool movement actually. I know where it got its inspiration from, but uh, like, still better than Spyro Reignited Trilogy, am I right? Okay, maybe that was a bit too far. I remember I used to struggle in this one for some reason, but it's pretty easy. Dude, I, you gotta have fast ass reaction for this. Nice, I got it. That was actually kinda hard. I'm a fucking master of this game already. This game is actually so unpopular. I looked at Twitch and there was like 200 followers for this game or something like that. This game really does look pretty considering it's on the Wii. Hey, future me here. So I decided to add some interesting facts about every game to make the video more fun. The first fact is that this game actually came out before the movie Madagascar 2. Now that is rather interesting. Also, this game has the best Metacritic score on the Wii. Let's start playing football. <laughs> Ronaldinho That's why they used to call me the wall. Who the fuck would call someone the wall? Let's go. The goalkeeper is so little. How is that there? You can just knock him into the air with your head. I think I was probably stuck here as well somehow. Hey, who wouldn't back hey? Hey, hey, oh. Yeah, that's easy. So the second fact is that contrary to popular belief, this game never came out in Africa, which is a shame. Tie the rope, how the hell do you do this? A, C, B. A, C, B. Oh no. I gotta have a long term memory for this one then. Oh, oh. Whoa! Well now he can finally call himself a true metalhead. Yeah, don't try this at home, just in case. Well, you could have used motion controls there, that would have been a lot better. Dude, everyone knows what happened. Pretty much we crash. Sorry for spoiling that one. Oh my god, I remember this mission, I think. Penguin missions are the best in this game for sure, dude. Boom, 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 boom. Okay, I'll just do it without taking them out. Hey guys, before I forget, this video was sponsored by air, water, and Jesus motherfucking Christ. The Wii is the best console ever made, don't tell me. Dude, the people are so like unthreatening in this game. Like there's no way they'd ever catch me or something. Fuck. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> Why did I have to say that? That's like instant karma, man. Let's just take the whole blanket. He won't need a blanket, obviously. Alright guys, so the third and final fact about this game is that I recently got the fastest speedrun of this game on the Wii. And that was only with two days of practice. What? Why did my tire start floating? Is that normal? Alex is a stupid Now, as you can see by the gameplay, everything was going quite smoothly until something absolutely terrible happened. Oh my god, how did I make that? He was right in front of it. Yep, the game fucking crashed. Just my luck. The crash corrupted all of my game data, and somehow it also made the game so much louder 
that now it's impossible to hear me speak during the rest of the stream. I decided I wasn't in the mood to play Madagascar again from the beginning, so I decided to move on to Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. I definitely overhyped this game a lot. First of all, these graphics look absolutely shit, even for the Wii. Like look at this character model for example, is that a turtle or a fucking bat? But the absolute worst parts of the game are the random fights you have to have all of the time. They happen so often that sometimes you need to finish a fight, go up the stairs and another fight starts straight away. That wouldn't be the biggest problem if the controls weren't so goddamn bad. First of all, they want you to use motion controls for attacking. But the game reacts to the motion controls like 2 seconds late. The second problem is that the motion controls are used for both blocking and attacking. So often you will block many times instead of attacking. So that was it for Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. I was already bored after 20 minutes of playing it. And to think that it was one of my favorite games at some point. Insane. So since I hadn't completed a single game yet, I decided to pick a game that I already knew how to play. And that game was New Super Mario Bros Wii. Nothing really interesting happened during this playthrough, but I did manage to beat the game, so success. And now time for some good old Sonic Unleashed. This is probably one of the best Sonic games no one ever plays, and it's a shame. Although it can be a bit infuriating because of all the glitches it has. But on the other hand, the glitches can sometimes really save your life. The fighting in this game is a lot more polished than in Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. But sadly, I did not finish the game because I thought that it was too long to beat in one day. And that's about all I have to say about this game. Next up, Super Mario Galaxy 2. It was going quite great until the 16th stop. Some peasant came to my stream and told me that the game audio was too loud and he couldn't hear me speak. So I fixed the audio but at that point I was so mad that I just rage quit the whole stream. Can't stream any longer. This fucking bullshit. Hey, future me again. I just wanted to tell you that this video took a really long time to edit and I would appreciate it if you would like, like it and subscribe. Hope you have a great day and bye.